you get Thursday. All week long, President Obama has kept a pretty low profile in the health care fight. That's about to change. He'll join conservative radio talk show host Michael Smirkonish. Call in for him. It's sort of a surreal environment for a guy like me to be seated here. Me in too. this room. <laughs> Movie National Treasure 2. You've been provided the book of secrets. I would tell you, but I'd have to kill you. Right. Did Secretary Sebelius misspeak last weekend? Yeah, she really didn't misspeak public option. We've said that's a good idea, but we haven't said that's the only aspect of health insurance. Our position hasn't changed. Until I heard you say that a private option is just a sliver of your health care proposal recently, I thought that pretty much was your proposal. I know. Just pure misinformation out there. Thank you for taking my call, Mr. President. Hey, Joe, how are you? Um, oh, I'm scared out of my mind talking to you here. Feels like the knees are buckling a little bit. Are your knees buckling? I guarantee you, Joe, we are going to get health care reform done. President Obama's multimedia blitz on health care. Everybody, yeah, the media obsessed. There's something about August. Everybody in Washington gets all wee-weed up. <laughs> We're going to have to cut through a lot of nonsense. Turns out a huge proportion of the American people are convinced health reform means illegal immigrants are going to get health care, government takeover, funding abortions. But what's the other one? Death panels? You know, pulling the plug on grandma. Now, <clears throat> come on. Where are these lies from? Look, we know where. If you just flick channels, then stop on <laughs> certain ones. Huh? The best offense against lies is the truth. The easiest thing is to do nothing. But that's not why I came here. There are a whole bunch of folks in this town. They want to write about all the naive, idealistic folks. Change we can believe in. All their hopes were dashed. You can't get anything done in this town. Can't change things. That's the storyline they're operating on. Storyline we've been fighting against this entire time. We are not going to give up now. <laughs>